Mayra is here. Hey, Mayra Figueroa. Hey, girl. Brandy is here. Danny, who is, excuse me, Danny. Hey, Danny. Um, Troiler Slay is here. Hey, Troiler Slay. Somebody named Troy N. Tilly is here. Diane, I think is your name. Bella is here, who is Fandal, Fan Dandelion. Fan Dandelion. Why was that so hard to say? Um, hello, everybody. Good day to you. Hello. Good evening. Um, let's wait until everybody gets here. Uh, should I, I think I should take some, like, a picture and post it on Instagram, I guess, um, saying that I'm live. I'm, I'm posing. Mm, what do I want to do? <laughs> uh, there we go. <sighs> that was such a struggle. Okay, I need to send that to myself. I'll be out of the loom, you know, i out of the loom, you know, i out of the loom. Okay. Um, then I need to take the link and send that to myself. I know, it takes a second, okay? Just give me a second. I'm, I'm sending things, I'm making sure that I can Instagram. Thank you for joining me on this lovely Tuesday evening. How are you guys? I got some complaints that I did not do this at an opportune time. Sorry, it's not like I'm not busy myself. Um, but yeah, you know what, I will, I mean, I would love to do more live streams. I'm just like, y'all know, y'all see the hustle? Y'all know that I'm running around very, I'm a busy boy. Um, hold on, I'm Instagramming, so. Uh, let's, let's post this on Instagram. Um, if you're here, hello, I am live. Come watch and hang out. Lots of fun. Wait, hold on. I'm out of the woods, I'm out of woods, I'm out of the woods. Okay, I'm just gonna, uh, like. Okay. Sorry, I'm just texting myself the caption because it's a lot easier than writing it out on my phone. I'm telling you guys, this is the struggle. I tell you what. Um, I'm about to I'm about to tell you everything. I'm about to get into the details. I'm about to tell you what's up in my life. Just give me a second. Um, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. That is posted. Now I'm going to post this on Tumblr. This is all a lot, you guys. Reblog, if you're watching. Okay, cool. I think that's posted. Um, so if you want a shout out, all you gotta do is retweet my latest tweet saying that I'm live. Uh, there are currently 2,000 people here, only 1,000 retweets. So let's give some shout outs to people that are in the room. Natasha's here. Utain is here. Hey, Utain. Amber Lynn is here. Nadine Daly is here. Caitlin Tiny House is here. Taylor Ara Guy is here. Caitlin is here. Um, Lily with like 11 L's is here. Carissa Delgado is here. Hey, Carissa. Kylie Cow Calwell is here. Ky Kylie Calwell. Beautiful name. Um, we're just going to make sure everyone's here before we get into the business of what's going on tonight. Um, hi. I'll do more shout outs in a minute. Don't you fret. Um, I'm in a dancey mood, and I wish I could tell you why. I just spent my afternoon dancing. Not for anything. Don't start speculating. Um, but you'll find out soon. Um, it's not like, you know. It's for a video. You'll see why. Um, so I'm like, kind of like, a little bit of like, <sighs> So here's the thing, this hashtag, if you got things you want to tell me, if you got questions you want me to ask or answer, if you got stories you want me to tell, if you got anything that you want me to talk about, use that hashtag, hashtag Tyler Oakley Livestream. Um, I'm going to be checking in on that all day, all night. Um, let's see. Oh. Oh, girl. Who the fuck? Who the fuck? Um, let's see. 
Can we get that trending? I think we could. I think we should. Um, if you're tweeting along, great. Uh, more importantly, I think we have to talk about this. Can I? Can we do something? I'm obsessed. Honestly, the song. The song, incredible. Um, what do you guys think? Taylor Swift's new song, Out of the Woods. I'm digging it. I'm loving it. I'm digging it. I'm loving it. Um, kind of. Wait for. Um, Y'all are paying attention, y'all are watching. I just Instagrammed, I just tweeted, I just tumbled, I just Facebooked, all that I'm live. If you are here, let's do some Tumblr shoutouts. Who wants a Tumblr shoutout? All you gotta do is go to tylerkley.tumblr.com, reblog my post that I just posted saying that I'm live, so that I know that you are here too with me, and so you can tell all your friends that you are watching. Uh, let's give some shoutouts to Tumblr users who have reblogged. And then I'm gonna get into the business. First, I wanna give you guys some shoutouts because y'all are here hanging out with me. So first, some shoutouts. Tumblr shoutouts. Um, Minty Nugget is here. Babe Zion is here. Uh, Take Me But Not My Beat is here. Um, that's the Pointless Sug is here. Stop YouTube Time is here. Uh, a Troiler Booty Call is here. Some interesting names up in this bitch. Um, Kiki Berry is here. She says, oh my god, I'm watching this. Hey, Kiki Berry. Uh, Veronica Malo is here. She says, my queen is on! Um, your Jack Socks is here, who says, watching with my pancakes. Who has pancakes? Who's got pancakes without me? That's pretty rude. It's pretty disrespectful. Who, who do you think you are enjoying a nice pancake without me? Emma Stacy says, this is going to be my first live stream that I've ever watched. Welcome. I used to do these all the time. Honestly, the last couple of years, I, 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 I hate that I've got, well, I mean, I love that I've gotten super busy, but I also hate that I've gotten super busy because it, like, limits how much I can do this. I used to do these all the time for, like, literally three or four hours at a time, just me hanging out with you guys. Um, and I always have a lot of fun. What do you guys think? Use the hashtag. When you, when you tweet... Any, th any tweets that you tweet, use the hashtag so I can, because I'm going to be tracking your tweets like that. That's how I'm going to keep up with you guys. Is that okay? Is that okay? Um, happy birthday to Zion. Um, wait, 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 wait. Um, we're going to talk about cheek to cheek. Mova Meka wants me to talk about cheek to cheek. Lord knows I will. Um... Spooky Catherine says, when are you coming to New York so we can embrace in my giraffe onesie? I will talk about that. I will talk about tour. I will talk about everything. Stay tuned. I'm going to talk about everything. Is that okay? Is that good? Is that a deal? Um, but I do need y'all to tweet along with the hashtag. Hashtag Tyler Rickley Livestream. And um, submit any questions you want me to answer. And if there's questions that you see in your timeline that you specifically want me to answer, retweet those questions so I can see those. You know what I mean? Um, are we out of the woods? Are we out of the woods? Are we out of the woods? Am I going Ashton Irwin on you? Listen. Like, maybe. <laughs> I was going to say, if somebody wears socks, are you going to be like, are you wearing socks? Because, like, Lady Gaga once wore a sock. No, girl. No, girl. No girl. Um, XX the Runaways or XX the Runaway XX says first live stream ever. Hashtag in love. Thanks, girl, for hanging out. Um, so, like I said, I'm gonna be talking about a whole bunch of stuff today. Uh, thank you for joining me. There'll be a lot of fun. If you are in the room right now, go retweet my latest tweet if you want to uh, like a little shout out. Um, let's see. Let's see who wants a shout out. Anybody want a shout out? There's a lot of people in the room that deserve shoutouts. Let's see who retweeted my last tweet. Uh, Haley is here. Sydney 
who's, well, it's Sydney is here, Roy Herb is here, Tilly's Nugget is here, Bella VMTZ is here, Sammy, wait, no, Sammy, Tony Marie is here, Troy Boy Tilly is here, who's Kara, uh, whose um, Twitter bio is hashtag team internet, holla, um, ooh, Callum Loves X is here, um, one vs another, one versus another is here, um, Angelina Velonis is here, um, a lot of people are here, a lot of people, a lot of people, people y'all, uh, other tumblers that are here, Marvel's My Name dash comic, comics not my game, that's a very intense tumblr user -o. Um, oh my god, I can't say that URL. That has a, a bad word that I can't say. Uh, Aqua Unicorn is here. Romantic Mindfuck is here. Um, lots of fun people. So, what's going on? What's go what's, let me ask you a couple questions. Somebody says, what is your shirt? It's my shirt. It's a normal shirt, but it's inside out. Um, because I had to put my shirt inside out today. For a reason. <laughs> Some things, I swear to god, there's so much that, you know what? Like, I want to tell you a million things, but then I can't because, like, I'm not allowed to yet. And so I'm like, oh, don't worry. You'll know soon. But, like, then I can't tell you because I'm like, there's things I can't say yet. Um, so, what's been going up with you guys? What's going up with you guys? What's been going on with you guys? Tell me with the hashtag. Use the hashtag. I want to know the answer to this question. What's up with y'all? What's going on? Anything? What's going on? I'm reading the hashtag. Bandanas were banned at your school, Ashlyn? That's, that's, that's a lot for me. Um, are you muke as fuck? I don't know what that means. Is that a, is that a, a ship name? Who would that be? Michael and Luke? Muke? Um, I don't think I'm muke as fuck. I don't think so, girl. I don't think so. Um, what all is going on in my life right now? Let's see. A couple things, a couple things. Um, we got, first and foremost, y'all have been voting uh, for the out 100. Um, if you go to, here, let me see what percentage, what's the, the verdict right now? We are 10% above second place. So we have... 36% of the votes. We are currently in first place. What if... Here's a challenge. Why don't, why don't we do a little challenge? If y'all vote right now, you can vote as many times as you want. Um, the, link to, the link to it is bit.ly slash out100 Tyler. bit.ly slash out100 Tyler. If we get to 50% of... The total amount of votes, I'll go get my hula hoop from today's new video. Is that, is that a deal? That could be fun. So let's, let's have like a power vote minute. We are currently at 36%. I think we could get there so quick. Bit.ly slash uh, out100 Tyler. Um, I think we named Taylor Swift to be the soundtrack of it. Don't you think? I'm gonna find the song right now. Here we go. Here we go. Is this it? Ah, the audio was taken down. Let me find it. I guess I could buy it on iTunes. But my iTunes on this computer is all messed up. Is this it? This might be it. Taking ad assets to release. An gas. ad? Spoiler alert. And as. Hold on. That's not it. <laughs> that ain't it, girl. I guess I'll just buy it. Should I just buy it? I should just support the queen. Um, the queen of pop, now that she is no longer the queen of country. Uh, let's find Taylor Swift. Here we go. Right front, front of iTunes. Dang, that placement. Um, okay, I'm buying it. I'm doing it. Password. Entered. Cool. 
great. Sometimes iTunes, putting in all my like information about that. I swear. Yes, I want to buy it. Done. Oh my god. I swear, y'all. Some things. Okay, we are voting. If you want to know how to vote, bit, B-I-T dot L-Y slash out 100 Tyler. O-U-T 100 Tyler. You can vote as many times as you want. Let's get to 50% of the votes. I think y'all can do it. We were just at 36%. Let's see right now what we are at. 36.9. So we already just got a percent. Y'all, 45, almost 5,000 people are here. Bam. We could do that in like a minute. Let's do it. We should try to do it by the end of the song. Y'all have three minutes. Vote as many times as you want. Let's do this. Is that good? And then, and then I'm gonna go get my hula hoop. Deal? <laughs> I am like obsessed with my hula hoop, by the way. Okay, let's do this. Now that Taylor is paused, because we're taking a break from voting, um, we should do some Q&A. Who's got a question that they want, who's got a cue they want to be slayed with? Does that make sense? Who's got a cue with a sleigh that they want, 
Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods? Okay, let's do some Q&A. If you got a question, submit it with the hashtag Tyler Oakley Livestream. I am refreshing the hashtag now. Let's see what questions we got. Oh, hula hoop. Well, we'll do that. We'll do that once we can see how many votes y'all just got. Deal? Um, who's got a question? I'm looking. At, I'm looking for questions. Questions. Are you yay or nay for a Mean Girls reunion? Asks Chiara Philbrook. Great question. Great question. Great question. Wait, I can't even speak. Great question. That's a great question. Um, am I yay or nay for a, a Mean Girls reunion? Well, I'm very yay. Do y'all remember, we once had a live stream a couple Halloweens ago, and um, Lindsay Lohan came to that. Lindsay Lohan was watching. I was drinking red wine, and she goes, girl, have you learned nothing from my past? Put down the wine. And I was like, oh, girl, that's, like, intense. Um, so am I down for a Mean Girls reunion? The answer, I think, is yes. I think so, yes. I just, I want it to be the only requisite. Requisite? Is that the word? The only thing that I need to be confirmed is I need Tina Fey to write it. Okay? Because that's the, that is the, I mean, everyone is great in the cast, but I, I will say I think the main reason why the movie was gold was because Tina Fey wrote it. Sarles, I'm gonna get real. Tina Fey is a god. So, there are some people that don't even know Tina Fey wrote it. Isn't that nuts? Yikes, girl. Okay, next question. Sergio says, how are you? Sergio, thank you for asking. I am good. I think I'm good. Um, I, today was a, a very intense day for me. Yesterday was an intense day for me. Um, I filmed today's video last night, and um, I was... I don't know if you could tell, I was a little exhausted, but I was like, you know what, I'm, I've been tr really, 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 really trying to stick to Tuesdays and Fridays. Um, so I was like, I, I th it, it didn't help, I mean, it did help that it was a video that I wanted to film, which is a P.O. Box video. I love doing P.O. Box videos, they're so fun, because I get to read you guys' messages, I get to read your letters, I get to open packages, and like, um, I also open stuff that you guys give me at, like, conventions or meetups or whatever, um... So it's fun because, like, I get to, like, I guess just read what you guys have to say or see what you think and stuff like that. So, um, the P.O. Box video was fun to film. I was just tired because I had a really long day. But I think, I, I like how it turned out. Do, do you guys like to? I love it. It was so fun. Um, let me see how it's doing. Let me go to youtube.com slash Tyler Oakley. Um, yeah, I mean, it's got 36,000 likes. That's pretty good. I always judge a video by, I mean, here's the, here's the truth about the like button. You know, when people are like, like this video, if you like this video, um, it doesn't, like, nobody gets paid from that. Sometimes people think that, like, it's like a trick for you to do that. It, honestly, it's how I, and a lot of YouTubers, kind of judge what y'all think of the video. We just spent a lot of time filming and editing and uploading. Um, so, like, if somebody, uh, if you push like, it... I mean, to me, that just means you liked the video, and that's, like, the gratification, or not the gratification, the response that I'm kind of looking for when I make a video. I hope that you guys like it, obviously. Um, so it's got 36,000 likes. Thank you if you've liked it. Um, it means a lot to me. Anytime that I say, like this video, um, it does mean a lot to me. It does, I mean, it doesn't do much. It just tells me if you liked the video or not. Um, and I always hope that you guys like the video. So that is what happened yesterday. And I filmed half of this Friday's video, um, and I kind of told you guys a little bit about what Friday's video is about. I made a tweet that was a little ominous, um, but I was like, some things are changing. Um, stay tuned for this Friday, uh, because some things are changing. And um, I filmed half of it yesterday, and I'm going to film the other half, I think, on Thursday. Um because I'm, I've been, like, super busy. I wish I could film it tonight, but I'm doing this 
Um, and then I think I'm gonna like just hang out and rest and watch TV. And then I wish I could do it tomorrow, but I have like a full day tomorrow of work stuff. So, um, yeah, I filmed the first half yesterday and it was kind of all, it was intense. Um, I, I hate that I'm being so ominous, but like, you'll see it all on Friday, but I had a full apartment here, a lot of people here, um, for that. And so it's, it was kind of like a hectic day because there were a lot of people in my apartment and yes, I'm sorry. Um, So, yeah, and then today, I, um, me and Corey, as you guys know, I posted about it on Instagram, Corey and I went and um, recorded two brand new um, uh, podcast episodes, which was a lot of fun. Um, I think you guys are going to like these ones. What did we do? We did uh, next week's, which is topical, and so it's all like celebrity gossip stuff. So, um, it was so funny. We were laughing so hard while we were doing it. Uh, I'm excited for you guys to see it. And then, um, what else is the other one we did? I think we did the next one. Um, the cool thing about podcasts is we can go in and we just get in such a fun rhythm that we're like, let's do another. Like it, they last 30 minutes, the podcast. And Corey and I were always like, let's do another, like, let's just record another if we, because we have tons of, like, podcast episode ideas. We're like, let's just do, like, let's have fun and keep going. Um, so we filmed, uh, recorded two episodes today of the podcast. And then we went and got lunch, brought it back here, we ate here, and then, um, uh, then what did we do? Then we went to a secret little project thing that I had to go to today. Um, and the project thing is for something really kind of cool. Uh, it's something that I did, um, when did I do it? Last year, maybe. I guess last year I did a video kind of like this one. Um, and yeah, if you, I, I would say soon, but Lord knows y'all hate that word. It's going to be coming out in a few weeks. Um the video I filmed today. Uh, it was an interview slash game thing um, with somebody that... Uh, mm, you'll see. Hmm, what else happened today? What else, ha what else did happen today? Um, I listened to Out of the Woods a million times because I'm obsessed with it. I got... I was listening to... Who, what is the new music that I'm listening to? Betty Who's new album I was listening to all day? Uh, Jessie J's album came out today. I loved that. Um, and I realized I wasn't following her on Twitter, so I had to, like, follow her because I'm obsessed. Have you guys ever seen, um, the Jessie J, uh, subway performance of Who You Are? It's incredible. P.S. 5,000 people are here. Hi, everybody. Um, so, Corey's obsessed with Jessie J, so we were listening to that all day. Um, when is your po oh, Totes Twin says, when is your podcast about boys? We recorded that the first day that we ever did a podcast, any podcast episodes, and um, we still haven't used it yet, obviously, but uh, yeah, you'll have to see. I don't know. When we have a week off. That we Some episodes we just film, and we're like, we, who knows what this video will go up, but um, it'll go up eventually. Um, who knows? Uh, bang, bang. Katie Baino says, I am getting glasses. What should I get? I have these new glasses. Can you see them? Do you like them? They are Warby Parkers. Y'all, so y'all know I did, um, sometimes I talk about Warby Parker and y'all pick out what glasses I, I, I show you five pairs of Warby glasses and Warby Parker glasses. And then I say, you guys let me know which glasses I should pick. And y'all picked these ones. Um, so I got, I just got them in the mail this week and I'm like actually obsessed with them. Y'all picked a good pair, thankfully. Um, let's see, other Twitter questions. If you have a question, tweet me with the hashtag Tyler Oakley Livestream. Let's answer some more questions. How long can you handstand, says Mac. Girl, I don't know. That's, that's a hard one. Um, 
what percentage are we at with the out 100 votes? Let's see. I'm going to refresh. It might not work. I think y'all broke the website. Pretty sure y'all broke the website. <laughs> um, Mandy says, is your hula hoop a pretty hula hoop? Well, should I go get the hula hoop? I'm going to go get the hula hoop, okay? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods? Look at my hula hoop. Hello, hello, hello. Hello to you, hello to you. Um, this is my hula hoop. Hello. Um, I feel like I'm in American Horror Story Freak Show. Hello with my hula hoop. I'm in the circus. Um, I'm gonna put this down now. <sighs> Goodness gracious. Hello! <laughs> uh, yikes at me. Yikes at me! Let's see. Um, oh! Everyone, somebody wants me to ask, or I mean somebody wants me to talk about um, my new podcast. I just talked about my new podcast. I don't know. Do y'all like it? What do y'all think of the podcast? Are you guys listening to it? Like, it's a weekly thing. Um, Corey and I have always, like, well, I always talk about having a podcast. And I, like, in passing mentioned it to Corey months and months and months and months and months, and months ago. And I was like, would you ever want to, like, do it with me? Like, that might be fun. Um, and then it just, like, all happened. It, like, all happened. Um, and now we are seven episodes in. That's nuts. That's, like, crazy to me that we've already been doing this for seven weeks. Um, I'm going to check the podcasts. Let's see. Uh, so, the podcast. Here's an interesting thing about the podcast. Um, to be in the charts on iTunes for the podcast, people have to download... Uh, or well, so, To be in the top podcasts... You have to be in the most subscribed that week. So if you haven't subscribed already, it really does help me or Grace or Jenna or Shane if you do subscribe. Um, so I appreciate the people that do subscribe. And then to be in the top episodes per week, so those are two different charts. Um, top episodes on iTunes is determined on um, how many people download that week's episode. So it does help if you listen. Helping if you listen. It does help if you listen. Um, so, if you haven't listened, I hope you enjoy it. This week's episode is, this was so fun to film. We, um, the one that came out today, it was all about celebrity conspiracy theories. So we talked about, is, wait, let me pull up the, the, the iTunes description. Um, also, if you haven't already, and you're already subscribed, be sure to give the podcast a rating. It really does help. Right now it has 1,700 ratings. Uh, if you haven't, all you gotta do is go onto iTunes and give it five stars. That would help me a lot. Um, uh, but let's, I'm gonna read you the description of this week's episode of the podcast. It's called Celeb Conspiracy Theories. Rumor versus Trumor. You be the judge. This week, Tyler and Corey debate about the latest celebrity conspiracy theories. Who's hoo-ha? gave birth to the Antichrist. Which celebs are members of the Illuminati? Which, or no, help the boys answer these wild speculations on Larry Stylinson, Beyonce's real family tree, and Kesha's pee-drinking habits. <laughs> um, it was such a fun episode. It was so fun. And I think y'all are liking, um, uh, I think y'all are liking the, um, the podcast. So, thank you. Are we out of the woods? Hmm. Are we out of the woods? Are we out of the woods? Uh, and then some people are like, talk about the tour. I guess I could talk about the tour. Would you like me to talk about the tour? I can. Um, hold that thought. Bam! That was easy. Um, 
So the tour was incredible, you guys. I haven't talked about it at all on like a video yet or anywhere yet. Um, I went to the first two stops of the Tyler Oakley Slumber Party Tour. You guys. Okay, I'm gonna give you my undivided attention, okay? Because I wanna talk all about the tour. It was so much fun. Um, when I first announced the tour, I was like, I don't know if we should book like, or try to like fill like tiny little places because I didn't know if people would want to come or if blah, 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 blah. So um, the whole the whole thing was, will we be able to sell tickets? Would you guys want to come? Mm. Um, so I, I, I went with theaters that were about a thousand people. The Chicago stop, I think, had 1,200 people. The Michigan stop had, I think, 1,100 people. Like, so about the same. Um, and I... Uh, I was like, I don't know if people are going to buy tickets. And then y'all sold out the venues within like three days. So, of course, you guys are incredible. Um, where would you want me to come on tour if I were to go on tour next? That's the question. Do you, do you have a, a place you would want me to come to? Um, let's see what you guys say. Use the hashtag. Uh, y'all may have seen that while I was on tour... Okay, somebody says Connecticut, somebody says Portland, somebody says Australia. Um, a lot of people are like, is this going to be one of those dumb tours that only goes to one country? The answer is very plain and simple. Bitch, I'm going worldwide. Y'all will see eventually. I um, The hardest thing is carving out dates because... I get that you guys are able to come, but I have like the rest of my year kind of booked out and it's been like that for a long, long time. So I am working on more stuff. Some things are kind of coming into place. Some things are not. It's also kind of coordinating different regions together. Like this first, this, uh, first weekend of tour stuff with Chicago and Michigan because they're right next to each other and we could do that in one weekend. Um, and it was incredible. Um, the audience was, I can't even explain to you the vibe of the audience. It was the coolest feeling in the world. Both nights I had moments where I stopped. I stopped like talking. I stood in the middle of the stage. I looked out and I just like took it all in. And I was like, I, I could cry about it right now, like thinking about it. But like the audiences were like unbelievable, indescribable. Like I can't even, when I try to tell my friends about it, I have no words because you guys were so incredible. Um, the Michigan stop especially was insane because my family was all able to come and for my siblings to all see what I do and to see your guys' response to what I do or for my mom to come up on stage for a minute was just like everything felt so unreal. Um, so I think... Like, obviously, my, my favorite part is meeting you guys at the meet and greets and going up on stage and seeing you guys all in the audience. But another part that I wasn't thinking that I would love, um, that I had actually felt fallen in love with, is the fact that my friends and family can come and see you guys and see me with you guys and uh, kind of get a new understanding for what it is that I do. Because for the longest time, I've been doing this for seven years, and um, obviously, like... It's been a long time, but over that time, my the whole situation has kind of grown and changed, and, like, there's not really... It, it's just been developing for so long. So, like, this year has been completely different from last year, and last year was completely different from the year before. So, to be able to grow that and for them to see what it is today is just the best thing in the world, so... Oh, my God, I just drooled all over myself. Um, somebody says, I missed the Chicago spot. Will you be coming back to Chicago? I, when I was at Michigan, I was like, girl, I would love to do a whole Michigan tour. Um, so yes, it's not just going to be a uh, one-time stop at certain places. I might come to Chicago again. I might come, I might do LA three times. I might do certain places more than once. It kind of depends on what you guys want. Um, so yeah, but just because I did somewhere already doesn't mean I won't go there again. Just because um, I don't come to your town yet or don't announce it yet doesn't mean it can't happen in the future, um, and just because you are in another country doesn't mean that I won't come all the way to where you are. 
Um, and I was kind of talking to, so there's a whole team of people that helped put the, put the whole thing on. It's not just me. It's not just Corey. It's not just, you know, the whole crew, um, that are like my people. It's, um, there's stage production, there's lighting, there's set design, there's stage managers, there's sound equipment people, there's, um, prop people, there's assistants, there's blah, blah, blah. It's before the, the show happened there was a, an entire room full of people that were helping make it happen. So it's just kind of coordinating all of that. Um, it's, so it's not just what I can do. It's not just what uh, works for the, the venue or the theater. It's coordinating everything. So know that I'm trying to make it happen um, at a quick rate. Just know that I'm trying, okay? Um, and I was telling them when they were like talking about the future of the tour, I was like, you know what, it's so important for me to go to places that people don't go to. Like, for me to go to the most random cities or the most random states is important because I know that when I was growing up, I never would have had a chance to go to VidCon or go to Playlist Live or somewhere in the city or all these conventions or Playlist Tri-State in New York or, you know, like all these like different... Uh, like major places, I would have never had the chance to because I was my family was not rich. Like we didn't have money, or like I my my parents did wouldn't have gotten it. They would have been like, no, you can't go travel all the way over there, or you know all those things where it costs like money for a hotel or it costs money for a plane ticket. So I'm like, I want to go to the cities that don't get the chance to go to conventions. Not saying that I won't go to, like, L.A. or Florida, because they do have conventions, but I also want to make sure that I include places that people don't go to, or, like, artists don't go to, or YouTubers don't go to on tour. I want to go to where you guys where you guys actually are. Does that make sense? Um, because I know, girl. Like, I've been there. I get it. Um, it's, it's, are we out of the woods? 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 Um, so yeah, that's the deal about the tour. Just, it's kind of one of those things where you just gotta be patient. Sorry. But, it's a thing that I definitely want to do more of. So, you have that. Okay? <laughs> um... What else? Any other questions? Tweet me with questions right now. I'm going to answer some questions. Let's open up questions. Let's open up questions. Are we out of the woods? Are we out of the woods? Let's see. Um... Hmm, other questions. I'm just looking for other questions right now. Any other questions with the hashtag Tyler Clee Livestream? Uh, 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 um, not places where you want me to come. I've already talked about that. Renee says, can we keep a tally of how many times you've sang Out of the Woods during this live stream? You know, I could keep singing Out of the Woods. I could go to Into the Woods. Uh, Y'all know. Wait, are you guys excited for Into the Woods? It's coming up. Christmas, I think, or Thanksgiving, I forget which one. Um, I'm obsessed with Into the Woods. I was in Into the Woods in high school. I was the narrator, so I'm very excited to see the movie. I'm hoping they don't fuck it up. Um, I'm also excited for the Last Five Years movie. It's my favorite musical of all time, so I'm excited for that. Uh, but knowing how they did, like, Les Mis, I trust that this is going to be high-quality production shit. Um, I also love Meryl Streep, so that should be good. Um, what other questions y'all got? What questions? Let's see. Hmm. Do the Mockingjay call? I can't, I can only whistle like this. I can't do, like, a pitch. I can't do... 
Did I do it? No, I didn't do it. Um, I can't really do that. Sorry. I cannot do that! Are we out of the woods? Are we out of the woods? Am I gonna do another video with Miranda Sings? Asks Cassie. I would love to. She was so fun to film with. Even though I only, like, I just laughed the entire time. Yes, I would love to, obviously. Um... What other questions do you got with the hashtag? Favorite book at the moment? I'm currently reading... I'll show you. I already talked about it um, before in a video, but I'm currently reading... This is where I leave you. It's pretty good. I like it. Um, oh my god, you guys. I just saw Gone Girl. It was... Have you guys seen Gone Girl? It was so much to handle. Um... Have you guys seen the One Direction movie? What have you guys seen lately? What movies are out? Tell me with the hashtag. Um, I still haven't seen the One Direction movie. I'm a little behind on that. I was going to go the other night, but then it wasn't playing at the theater that I was going to. So I was like, Ugh. so I went and I ended up seeing Gone Girl instead, which was incredible. I gasped multiple times at the screen. I was like, the whole time I was like, no. There was one part specifically where something happened. I can't tell you what. And I literally, this was my exact response. And then as the scene was going on, I was like, and I was with my friend and I looked over and I was like, it was a lot. It was a lot. And you see Ben Affleck's dick and Neil Patrick Harris's dick. Two dicks, one movie. My favorite kind of movie. Um... It was a lot. It was a lot. Um, GBF. Kayla says she saw GBF. I like GBF. Um, Annabelle. I refuse to see that shit. <laughs> I'm not here for that. No, I'm not here for a scary movie like that. About like some type of doll? No queen. No. No ma'am. Not today, Satan. Um, what other movies? I don't know. Ouija? Is that out yet? Or is that just something the one, or the, uh, our, our Second Life boys are talking about? Who knows? Who hashtag knows? Just a simple whistle. Don't mind me. Um, uh, 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 um, do you realize how many GIFs were made right now? Of what? What did I do? I didn't do anything fun. Was it when I was like with my hula hoop bouncing? Is that a gif yet? If it is, holla. What up? What's going on? Um, let's see. What other questions do you got? What's your reaction to scary movies? I like scary movies that are also kind of funny. Like, I like Scream. I love the Scream series, so Scream 4 is my favorite scary movie. Because um, it, like, has a sense of humor about itself. And Courtney Cox, as Gail Weathers, is the best. She's just amazing. And, um, yeah, it's really good. But most scary movies, I'm not really into. Did y'all see Cabin in the Woods? Girl, that was good. That was a good movie. What other movies were good? What other scary movies? I don't know. Um... Into the Storm? I don't know what that is. Freak Show? No. Uh, is there anything... Was there anything that I promised I would talk to you guys about? I just want to make sure I don't forget something. I don't remember. I don't remember. Talked about tour. Talked about... Oh! I saw everybody's getting their, um, if you go to districtlines.com slash Tyler Oakley, they have, I have, like, new t-shirts, I have posters, I have stuff, I got things. Um, my iPhone case is all sold out. Would you guys want me to make more? Is that something you would want? Um, it's so hard because, like, with phone cases, some people have Android, some people have iPhone, some people have 4, some people have 4S, some people have 5, some people have 6. Is there a 6? I don't even know. So I'm like, can't make them all. So it's, like, hard to kind of tell what I should be doing. But if you guys want more phone cases, I guess let me know. Um, and then I have a different 
phone case idea that I was going to put out, but then I was like, I don't know if people want phone cases. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. It's a cute phone case, that, the one that I made, but I never used, I never sold. Um, so if that's something that I should do, maybe I will do. Um, what else? Anything else? I just want to make sure that I don't forget anything while y'all are still hanging out with me. Um, I don't know. Maybe we'll do some questions. If you go to, here's what we'll do. If you're watching my live stream, um, go to my new video, youtube.com slash Tyler Oakley. Click my new video. Um, and I'll do questions in the comments section. Yeah? That way I can give some shout outs to people's YouTube channels. Because I did Tumblr, I did Twitter. Let's see what, what questions or comments you have on the new YouTube video. Go. While you're there, push the like button. But let's see what we got. Um, Maggie says, will you, be do, will you be casually doing meet and greets while hula hooping at VidCon? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Wait, what if I had hula hoops at my meet and greets? That would be amazing. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> That's not a bad idea. I love, my favorite thing is at my meet and greets, I always make sure that I have like things for y'all to do because if you're, if you're just standing in line, that's not very fun. So at Playlist Live, I had like a photo booth in the room with iconic outfits from past videos. Um, so like certain costumes or certain like things that I've worn or wigs or hats or whatever. Um, like fun things that, were, that have ever been in videos, props and things that you could pose with with the photo shoot thing. Um, cause I was like, if my people are hanging out in a room waiting for me to like get through people so that they can finally meet me, like, cause the problem is I talk too much in meet and greets and at, like security always yells at me. Um, the conventions always yell at me and they're like, you need to hurry up. And I'm like, you need to fuck off. Like I'm talking to my people. So I'm always like, yes, it'll take forever, but I want to make sure that like I'm actually having conversations with people, not just like rushing through people. Cause I've seen meet and greet videos of certain people. Um, that just sit there and people run in, run out. And I'm like, no, I'd rather like at least say hello, ask where you're from, like talk about your outfit because usually y'all are looking cute, um, things like that. And uh, if I'm doing all that with everyone, it takes a while. So I try to have fun things. So yeah, I had the photo shoot with like cardboard cutouts of me so that you could do like fun poses that you wouldn't be able to do with a normal human. Um, what else have I had at my meet and greets? Um, once I had a poster that I had everyone at the meet and greet sign so that I could like keep that for myself. Um, what else have I done? I don't know. Sometimes I have candy. This past one in Chicago, um, a local, uh, popcorn company was like, we want to be a part of your tour. I was like, okay, donate a ton of popcorn to give to the meet and greet people so that they have something to eat while they're hanging out. Um, once I had like ring pops, um... I don't know. I always have, like, a ton of fun stuff. Because I'm like, I want it to be fun. It's not just, like, wait in line, get a selfie, leave. I want it to be fun. Um, other questions that are on the new YouTube video. Grace says, cookies or Taco Bell? I used to say Taco Bell, but I'm recently getting a sweet tooth, so cookies. Zach says, what's your favorite thing about MSU? Um, maybe tailgating. I miss tailgating a lot. Um, like by the tennis courts, y'all know, if you are in Michigan, you know the tennis courts for tailgating. I miss it so much. Um, what was my last dream about? Ooh, I don't know. That's a hard question. Jenna says, can you say, whoa, 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 like how we do in the podcast? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, Jenny says, are you still a directioner? Yeah, I love steal my girl. Steal, yeah, steal my girl. I always want to say steal your girl. Um, steal my girl. Yes. Did you guys see the video of, um, was it video or just pictures? I don't remember. Of Harry Styles puking on the side of the highway. Iconic. Love it. Love it. Love it. Um, Mary Kill Avoid from Mila Gross. She says, Mary Kill Avoid, Beyonce, Gaga, and Ariana. I would, mm, Mary Kill and Avoid. Aren't I supposed to fuck someone? <laughs> I, okay, I'm just going to fuck Mary Kill. I would mm, fuck Gaga, because I just feel like she has got to be a beast. I would marry Beyonce, and I would have to kill Ariana. I don't want to kill Ariana, but you got to kill somebody. Sorry, Ariana fans. 
Um, shout out to Barbados. Hey, Barbados. How you doing? Isn't Rihanna from Barbados? Or does she just say Barbados a lot? Then I'm going to show you how to graduate. Um, full story behind the exploding candle. Okay, I can kind of tell this story. So, I was having a party the other night. It was a surprise costume party. Um, and <laughs> uh, we were all here um, drinking and having a merry time. And then we, we heard the fire alarm. And Hannah Hart was like, is that the fire alarm? I was like, I don't know. That's like, wait, do you smell that? And she's like, oh, I smell that. That smells like smoke. So we go through this door. We come through that door. In my room, there's fire. Literally fire. A candle had exploded, which isn't supposed to happen, obviously, with a candle. Um, glasses are everywhere. Embers are everywhere. A book is, like, burning up. And we, like, put out the fire, like, like this a little bit. And then um, the fire alarm is going off, so we're, like, fanning the fire alarm. Um, luckily, nothing, like, got burned down, obviously. Um, but that would have that would have sucked so much. But... Um, there's, like, holes in my carpet now from the fire. Like, an actual fire happened. Um, so, that happened. Just an exploding candle. Normal. Um, Alyssa says, I'm applying to colleges. Any advice? I would say, don't be generic. And if you have to write an essay, don't be generic. Talk about your personal experience. What sets you apart? Because they read a million applications a day. They're looking for something that's going to be like, wow, this is a unique human. We need this person to be at our school. It's not all about grades. It's not all about numbers. It's not all about this or that or whatever. What is the one reason why they should want you at your, their school as opposed to you going somewhere else? Like, what makes you different from everybody else? That's what they're looking for. So that's that would be my advice. Set yourself apart. Um, uh, Blake says, what's a good way to start a channel? first video ideas. My first video was a tour of my dorm room. Um, and a good way to start a channel is to just start. That's the biggest thing. Um, like, that's the hardest thing, is to like make that first video. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, make your first video. Because a year from now, you'll wish you started a year ago. Does that make sense? Does that make sense, friends? Um, what else? First video ideas, though? Like an intro. Like a who you are. T talk about who you are. I can talk about myself for like five minutes. I can do that. Hi, I'm Tyler Oakley. If you don't know who I am, bitch, sit the fuck down. Shut the fuck up. It's story time, motherfucker. Does anybody know what video that's from? That's a classic. That's a classic Tyler Oakley video. If there is such a thing. Bum, ba -dum, bum. My friend Molly, who's in Awkward, just tweeted, Hey, I know you guys are trending Tyler Oakley, but can you also trend Awkward Senior Year? Thanks. <laughs> Oops, sorry Molly. Um, what else is going on? Anything else? I think that's about it. I think that's about it. Um, a couple things before I go. If you are watching this after this video actually happened, after this live stream actually happened, I'm sorry if you couldn't make it. I'm sorry it was so last minute. I was just like, you know what? I want to do a live stream. I want to hang out with you guys. Um, I love you. I will be doing more live streams, hopefully soon. Um, and spread them so that different time zones can get to watch. I know that it's not the easiest thing to do. I have people all over the world, and I am so thankful for that. But this was a convenient time to do it for me. Thus, I did it. But I will do some other convenient times for the people around the world. Deal? As far as the tour goes, you guys will be the first to know. As soon as a new tour stops are happening, I will tell you. Trust me. Um... As far as podcast goes, if you haven't subscribed already, please do, uh, and give it a rating on iTunes, and like the Facebook page. It's Psychobabble Podcast. If you search facebook.com slash psychobabblepodcast, I'm going to post some exclusive pictures to that page 
uh, I think either tomorrow or the next day, um, from the tour. So if you want to see that. Um, as far as this Friday's video goes, be sure to tune in, and hopefully you guys like it. I'm a little nervous about it, um, but I think you guys are going to like it, this Friday's video. Like I said, some things are changing. Come into it with an open mind. Okay. Um, what other stuff? Uh, today is the last day to vote for the Out 100 voting thing. Um, so if you haven't already, go vote. I think the website still crashed from when we were voting earlier. Y'all are intense voters. Um, let's see. Oh, no. It's working. Um, oh, wait. So then let's do a, a flash one-minute voting thing. Deal? L let's do some votes and crash the website one more time, okay? Out, so the website is bit.ly slash out... 100 Tyler. Bit.ly slash out 100 Tyler. Let's see what percent we can get to. We are at 37% right now. Let's see what we can get that to in the course of one new Taylor Swift song. Or, no, let's not do Taylor Swift. I want you to hear the new Betty Who song that I'm obsessed with. Is that okay? Can we do that? Oh my god. There's so much good new music. How about glory days okay go vote so preview betty who is this artist who i'm absolutely in love with we've done a collaboration before together um she's great she's amazing she's iconic she we did the humming challenge i have been supporting her for about a year and a half now and to watch her grow and to watch, be go to her like concerts is incredible i've been to a couple concerts now and to see like her fans grow, and you guys be a part of that is just the best. Um, she just released her new album. It's on Spotify. It's on iTunes. Go listen to it. But this is one of my favorite songs on the album. It's, like, so good. It's called Glory Days. Um, but we're going to listen to it while you guys go vote. B-I-T dot L-Y slash out 100 Tyler. Okay? I'm going to write that down because I don't know if you guys are picking up on that. What is this? What is this paper that I just ripped? Oh no! Oh okay. B i t dot l y slash out one hundred Tyler. This is the link. B i t dot l y slash out one hundred Tyler. Got it? You can vote as many times as you want. We're going to listen to this new song by Betty Who and see what percent we can get up to. I trust you guys to kill it. Let's try to get to 40%. Deal? Three, two, one.
100, 100 likes to go, 80 likes to go, 70, we're 40 to go, and we have like 10 seconds left, bam, 40,000 likes, y'all just slayed the game, why are you guys like, why are you so incredible, that's my question, like how do you do the things that you do, that's kind of like, it's, it's spooky, and it's eerie, kind of makes me think y'all are like demons, or like at least magical, or like witches, are y'all witches, do I got a whole bunch of witches? Oh, this song again. Can we play another song? Y'all want to play another song? Were you guys listening to when I did the, um... Oh, my mom's watching right now. Hey, hey, mom. Um, did you guys listen when I did the radio, the BBC radio thing? Was that yesterday? Yes, it was yesterday. Um, first and foremost, y'all made it trend the entire hour, worldwide. We were trending the entire hour of the radio show. BBC messaged me while it was going on. They were like, what's happening? <laughs> I was like, oh, you know, my people. Um, so thank you for listening. I had so much fun. I was like, I could have a radio show. What if I ever had a radio show? Would y'all want me to do that? Would y'all tune in? Would you listen? Who knows? I could do that. Maybe. Someday. Who knows? I had fun, like, making music. Or not making music, but, like, making, curating music. Um, that was a lot of fun for me. And then, like, I don't know, just, like, a fun time. Fun time, y'all. It was a fun time. Um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. And, uh, I was so thankful because Dan and Phil helped make that happen. And they were, like, they, because they're, it's their show, but they're letting YouTubers guest host. And, um, so that was really nice of them. So thank you, Dan and Phil. And then all the producers that helped with the show were so incredible, so... I really appreciate that. Um, but yeah, I just had a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. I got a lot of fun in love tonight. Okay. Um, what else? Is there anything else I need to tell you guys? You know what I do need to tell you? Please pick up a copy of Cheek to Cheek. <laughs> The new Lady Gaga jazz album. Um, I just got mine. I was in... Yeah, well, you'll hear the story eventually. I told the story in the podcast today, so you'll hear the story of the Cheek to Cheek when I went and got my Cheek to Cheek album. Um, what else do I have to tell you? Anything? No. Not really. Okay. Um, what else? Anything? I'm trying to think. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, here's the thing. The Psychobabble podcast um, Facebook page is six people away from 20,000 likes. So if you want to go like that, facebook.com slash psychobabble podcast. Um, Y'all just made it hit 20,000. Slay. Uh, but there's a reason to like it. If you, if you like the podcast, it, we're going to, I think what we're going to start doing is in the episodes, we're going to talk about exclusive stuff that you can go check out on the Facebook page. So if there's ever things that we want to be like, oh, I want to share. If we're talking about something, me and Corey, and we're like, oh my god, you guys have to see it. I'm going to post it on the Facebook page. You can always go to the Facebook page and see what we were talking about. Does that make sense? Um, but yeah, I think that's all for today. I think I'm going to get going. I need to go eat dinner and go chill. And yeah, because um, I had a crazy, 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 crazy day. And now I'm like, I just deserve to hang out. Um, this was a lot of fun. Thank you for hanging out with me. Um, voting ends tonight for the Out 100 thing, so if you want to keep voting, be sure feel free to do that. Feel free to. Um, I would appreciate it. And then, uh, yeah, I think that's it. I love you guys. I will talk to you later. Um, if there's any questions that I missed that you still want to ask me, I'll be doing a Q&A sometime soon. So check that out. Um, and yeah, okay. I love you guys. Um, thank you for being amazing. Thank you for making my dreams come true. Thank you for supporting my new videos. Thank you for, um, uh, sending me hula hoops. <laughs> thank you for, um, listening to the podcast. Thank you for coming to the tour. Um, thank you for being patient every time I say soon. Uh, thanks for crashing websites. Thanks for trending hashtags. Um, honestly... I am one of the luckiest people in the world because not only do you guys care about like the crazy fun stuff, like 
you know, games that we do or like silly videos or silly podcasts or whatever, but you also really care about the serious stuff, like when we raise money or when we help causes or when we do things for charity, y'all get involved. So thank you for being involved and a part of this community, um, no matter what it is that we're currently doing, whether it's a new video or a podcast or a tour or like a fundraiser, whatever it is, thank you for getting involved. Um, and that's it. Oh, one other thing. If, here's, here's, I, I just want to say one thing. Can I do one thing? Can I say one thing? Um, how am I going to put this? I have seen some, like, some people in our little community, um, feeling sad or feeling down or, um, like, saying, like, sad things, and I, and it breaks my heart because I can't interact with or I can't reach out to everyone because I don't always see everything, so I'm gonna ask you guys to, to make an effort to be there for people. Because I can't always do that. Like, I, like, I'm not on the computer all day long. Or I don't see every tweet. Or I don't see every message. Or whatever. Things like that. So if you see somebody in our little family that's going through something, reach out and say hello. And be nice to that human. Um, because I've been at low points. You've been at low points. Everyone in the fandom, in the family, has... Any fandom, any family, has had low moments. So if they need support... That could come from you. Um, if you uh, want to join the family, a good place to do it is in the Twitter community. Um, if you go in this hashtag, hashtag Tyler Ripley Livestream, and you, and if you feel like you don't have any Twitter friends, say that in the hashtag and reach out to people that want other friends and reach out to people that are saying hello and introducing themselves. Um, follow each other. That's my favorite thing is when I see you guys following each other and tweeting to me and like saying, Tyler, thank you for doing that. I found my best friend because of this live stream or because of whatever it is. Um, and then on Tumblr, if you want to find a good fun community, uh, the Tyler Oakley tag on Tumblr is always packed to the brim with you guys interacting and being friends and talking to each other. So I just had the weirdest breathe in. Did you hear that? I was like, um, but yeah, if, you, if you're looking for internet friends, this is a fun little family. Please be inclusive. If you see somebody reaching out, reach out right back. Um, but yeah, that's all I have to say. I love you guys. I will see you guys s later. <laughs> and yeah, until then, have a good life. And yeah, okay. Bye, friends. Later.